<laughs> yeah. We're all over Thanksgiving, right? It's, yeah. it's, it's done for. We, we hate banter, but we're not going to do banter. Um, yeah, we hate banter. It's the worst. Uh, no, we're we're going to do some long form improv for you. Uh, we're going to get a suggestion from you, and then we're just going to kind of riff on that for a while, and we'll see where it goes. Uh, tonight, we need from you an opening line of dialogue. Uh, uh, maybe it's something you said earlier today. Maybe you're just making it up right now. Whatever it is, whoever has a good one, yell it out. My teeth listen. My teeth listen? Listen. Listen. Ah. Dude, where's my spaceship? Dude, where's my spaceship? Chocolate peanut butter? My My spaceship is listening. Okay. Let's do that. <laughs> my spaceship is listening. Thank you. Yeah, he's insane. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's right, Rick. I did get a boat. You see, you listening? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, spaceship. That's a cool name. Yeah. Yeah. I was going to name after my ex wife. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, I named it spaceship. So, I wanted, so where I want to go after she left me, I want to go to outer space. Just away from everything. You got a minute to talk. Sure. <laughs> It's just, it's beautiful. I've never, I've never seen a replica car like that before. Look, even the ship is glistening. Yeah, and it's great. I put some sequins on his ship. I put, I put sequins on his ship to make it glisten. I've never seen a diorama like that before. It's amazing. It looks really well done. That's great. My teeth are glistening. Okay, that's good. <laughs> My teeth can hear. Jeremy, that's great. We've been over this, okay? This, we asked for a diorama on Plymouth Rock at Thanksgiving. For this is space. I know. <laughs> That's the problem. You don't, you don't like it, Mrs. Wallace Javits? I like it. <laughs> I think it's very unique, and I, and I like creativity. I do. I wrote that on the wall. I like creativity. <laughs> so it's a safe space for that. But we also have to follow the rules, don't we? Well, but, so here's the thing. Okay. It's a way to interpret it. Okay. <laughs> because you have to realize uh, that Bill Worms and Christopher Columbus? Uh -huh. See, that's all a fallacy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what actually happened, okay. a couple of space age aliens, uh -huh. <laughs> they came down, uh -huh. they landed on Plymouth Rock, uh -huh. but they were space age aliens. <laughs> <laughs> they were space age aliens. <laughs> they were space, space, space aliens. <laughs> oh, I, just a humble pilgrim moving this hay with a pitchfork. <laughs> <laughs> Failed to see how the robots come into play. 
Oh, they're very important. <laughs> Let's hear it. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. <laughs> so long, Mr. Alien. Ah, now we can get back to this normal late November. Motherfucker! <laughs> Stop, man. <laughs>
Yeah. 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 Quite 
literally the exact yeah. opposite. I'm proud of you. But hey, he tried. He leaves audio. That's right. <laughs> now we're going to bed at 4.30. <laughs> it's the little things, you know? Yeah. Where's your other kid? <laughs> That's going to be a problem. Don't say so! No! <laughs> Dollars. I see a question right there. Two question you got, sir. Yes, sir. Question. Yar. Yes, sir. What is it <laughs> to play to pay him to lose? <laughs> sir, once again, this is going to be a, a USD American dollars. Oh. You had a three hour period where you can get that exchange at the bank in order to transfer over. I don't know which banks accept the blues. Anyone want to buy any the blues? I could, any taker. I could be interested. Uh, oh, all right, we'll start the bidding at five dollars. No, <laughs> the question was the auction half house. Okay, what's the question? Has he's got his kid, people? Well, that's not at liberty for me to talk about. We don't need to know where the guns have been. We're just trying to figure out where they're going to go. Second question. <laughs> okay. Do you have a gun that perhaps a hedgehog could use? <laughs> 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 uh, well... Sure, it might seem like an unorthodox question, but I'll just tell you, if it's a thing, we can put a gun in. <laughs> What's it? An exquisite answer. Thank you. No problem. Any other questions? Yeah, I got one. Yeah. Uh, you guys have the 76 Smith & Wesson six-shooter. You know, the one that I was featured in uh, that Burt Reynolds movie? Yes, we do. Okay, cool. Yep, Cobb and a Half. Favorite movie. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that real movie? Is that a real movie? That's a real movie. That's a real movie. All Burt Reynolds movies just kind of blur the guy. I was just testing you. Oh, that's above and beyond the best one. Okay. <laughs> I'll take your word for it. It's a real funny little buddy cop movie. I don't need to hear about it. Burt Reynolds is a, <laughs> Burt Reynolds is a real rough and, rough and tug it on the outside. Uh, getting too old for this shit kind of cop, kind of a lone ranger, but wouldn't you know it, he gets set up with a little eight-year-old. They bust a crime together because he saw a murder happen. Come <laughs> <laughs> on, Mr. Talor! <laughs> well, let's just say they find friendship in a very unlikely place. Wow. Yep. <laughs> Who knew? man with such a thick emotional wall, all he needed was the whimsy and playful imagination of an eight-year-old to teach him a real lesson. Sometimes, sometimes we can learn from the people that we think know the least. Yeah, I agree. And I may only be eight myself, but I want a gun. Oh boy, do I. <laughs> Yar, what do you need a gun for? Well, I don't know. Just looking cool, I guess. Flexing. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a great point. That's why it's just a status symbol, you know? Back in the day, I feel like I was having like a nice car or suit. I don't know, I just want to feel cool, you know what I mean? Sure. Look, I'm not here to judge on the reasonings of why you need to have a gun. All I know is that this uh, vault or what have you has just been reopened for the first time. A whole bunch of guns are in it. We have to sell them. Okay. Hello. Yeah. Can I help you? Turkey. Turkey. <laughs> turkey. Turkey. <laughs> turkey. Turkey. Sorry. What? Lee said he just moved here from out of town. He's got a whole bunch of American money. <laughs> Look, sir, as long as your money is good, you're more than welcome to you come in and bid just like anybody else. Really, we should be getting to this auction. Turkey. We we believe you, okay? That's totally fine, sir. Turkey. He's saying turkey, but it's American dollars! <laughs> Stuffing. <laughs> Stuffing. Turkey. Stuffing. Turkey. Stuffing. Turkey. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, Daniel, the robot are having a blood feud! Oh my god! That'll sort itself out. Look, 
you like to talk about? I'm old enough to be your father twice. <laughs> okay. Um, how much is this lantern? That's uh, five dollars out the door. Oh, okay. Sweet. Right. Should be selling it for fifteen. Don't tell the wife. I'll, I'll get even more mad. At you. I'll pay fifteen for it. I didn't think so. No, you don't have to. five dollars out the door. Okay. Thank you, Andrew. It's seventy-five. Hmm. Three seventy-five. Really? <laughs> That's so weird. I worked at I worked at Cedar Point a long time ago as like the the weight age height uh, tester, yeah, yeah. and I always think it's not gonna stick with people, but I still got it. You know, yeah, it's fun. especially with really old people like you, it's just kind of hard to tell because <laughs> like you know some people get really wrinkled, but they're only like fifty, and then some people are so old but they're like ninety and they're fairly wrinkled. You know, sure. it's a little bit more difficult. There. You're but too you, young to know how much of an asshole you be. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I just, I didn't, oh, I didn't mean, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to like okay, that. It's okay. No, 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 I just didn't mean to okay. it as an observation, like a human to human okay. thing. I just, I'm sorry. No, it, it was it was my fault. I'm sorry. I'll get out of here. Let me ask you a question. Yeah, sure. Is there a lady in your life? Uh, I mean, not currently, but... But you got one in mind. I, I said lady, and I know one came to mind. Okay. Yeah. How much for yeah, this? Too. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Three fifty for the little pink call. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Is you are you are you married or? <laughs> My Mary. <laughs> you don't have to, you don't have to answer. It seemed like you wanted me to ask. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Can you hear that? Is this price for just one of the Mad Magazines or all of them? Hey. <laughs> what? How much? Does she ever break your heart? Oh boy. Uh, <laughs> no. It was kind of a That's mutual, good. mutual thing. See if you can keep that streak alive. Okay. You know how embarrassing it is to get married at 75 in the first place? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I'm so sorry. Jilted. At the altar. Oh, this my. afternoon. <laughs> this afternoon? <laughs> Holy shit, what are you doing here? Where else am I gonna go? I, I, I either come here or I go where I want to go. I'm so sorry. I'm sure. Oh, oh, I'm sure she had a reason. It's not fair to you, but you know she clearly wasn't the right one. If she was willing to do that, you know. Why do you, Why do you think she left? Hey. Hey, listen to me. I've taken a couple communications classes in college, and I think the best thing you need to do right now is to talk through this, okay? Let's talk through it. Confront your fears. Why do you think she left you, Andrew? <clears throat> Teach you well at University of Phoenix. Yeah, they do. <laughs> yeah, they do. Phoenix Pride. <laughs> 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 I didn't know there was somebody else in the picture, all right? <laughs> <laughs> she just said she had a thing with somebody else, but she was going to end it, okay? I didn't know. 
that it was marriage, all right? You go. Go on. Just trapping little 23-year-old. When I was your age, I could kick your ass in a foot race. Now get the fuck out of here. Go! Go on! Thank <laughs> you. 